Mapuche is a region in eastern Montenegro and a historical tribe. The region is located northeast of Pojorica, and extends along the border with Albania. The majority of inhabitants are Serbian Orthodox Christian while a Muslim and Roman Catholic minority exists. Marko Miljanov led the tribe against the Ottoman Empire in the wars of 1861-62 and 1876-78. He had unified Kuchi with Montenegro in 1874. Geography the region is located northeast of Pojorica, and extends along the border with Albania, with the Kelmand region on the other side of the border. The unofficial center is the UBLI village, which has about 1,500 residents and houses several institutions like a culture hall, the Thoko Prelevich Elementary School, a hospital, police station, and a former fabric factory. UBLI is situated in central Kuchi with the center in villages of Prelevici, Pavasevici, Zivkovici, Kostrovici, etc. Other villages are Meduns, Orahovo, Fundina, Kochi, Kranja, Kosor, Verbica, Stravsa, Zagreda, Raci in northern Kuruchi and Doljani, Mertovina, Stara Zalatica, Zalatica in southern Kuchi. The Kuchi region itself can be divided into three major historical subregions. Old Kuchi, Orthodox sub-tribe, which celebrates the Slava of Mitrovden. Drekulovici, Orthodox sub-tribe, which celebrates the Slava of Nikolgen. Zatry Jebak, also known as Kuka Krajina, mixed Albanian and Orthodox sub-region, which celebrates the nativity of the Theotokos. Includes the settlements of Benkaj, Buja, Sijevna, Delij, Karita, Moteska, Nikmaris, Rudin, Poprit, and Stiepovo. History Middle Ages The legendary progenitor of the Kuchi, Nena, and his sons, were mentioned in the 1416-17 register of the Sanjak of Skatari. Nenad descended from an Orthodox, Serb, noble family. According to folklore, this family was the Mernjevcevic family. Nenad was the son of Goko Mernjevcevic. 16th century The old Kuchi constantly were in conflict with the old Gruda. The Kuchi were stronger, thus they stole livestock from Gruda. And if only one Kuchi would be killed in conflicts, and several Gruda, they would penalize the whole tribe. In a 1582-83 Stefta, the Kuchi Nahia had 13 villages belonging to the Sanjak of Skatari. 17th century According to Venetian public servant Mariano Bolitsa, the Cucci were Albanian of Roman right. In Bolitsa's report from 1614, the Cucci, Bratanozici and part of Plava were under the soldiers of Medans the Spahi, but the commander was not named, and the Highlanders would pay the Ottoman officials a portion of their income. Under the leadership of Lael Drekarlov, the Catholics of Kuchi converted to Orthodoxy. In the second half of 1614, the Kuchi, Papery, and Kelman sent a letter to the kings of Spain and France claiming they were independent from Ottoman rule and did not pay tribute to the empire. Between 1614 and 1621 the Kuchi were mentioned as Ottoman subjects. In 1658, the seven tribes of Kuchi, Vasayevici, Bratanozici, Paperi, Clementa, Hoti and Gruda allied themselves with the Republic of Venice establishing the so-called Sevenfold Barjak, or Alij Barjak, against the Ottomans. In 1688, the Kuchi, with help from Clementa and Paperi, destroyed the army of Sulman Pasa twice, took over Medan and got their hands of large quantities of weapons and equipment. In 1689, an uprising broke out in Paperi, Rovskar, Bielopavlasai, Bratanozici, Kuchi and Vasayevici, while at the same time an uprising broke out in Prizren, Pek, Pristina and Scorpia, and then in Kratovo and Kriva Palanka in October. In 1694 the Kuchi allied themselves with the Hoti in yet another uprising against the Ottomans. 
Throughout the 18th century, the Cucci fought alongside the Vasai of Itchi, Hoti, and Clementa. 18th century in 1774, in the same month of the death of Skepin Mali, Mehmed Pasha Bushati attacked the Cucci and Biela Pavlisai, but was subsequently decisively defeated and returned to Skatari. Bushart he had broken into Kuchi and destroyed it. The Rovskani housed and protected some of the refugee families. In 1794, the Kuchi and Rovskani were devastated by the Ottomans. 19th century The Ottoman increase of taxes in October 1875 sparked the Great Eastern Crisis, which included a series of rebellions. Firstly with the Herzegovina uprising, which prompted Serbia and Montenegro declaring war on the Ottoman Empire and culminated with the Russians following suit. In Kuchi, chieftain Marko Miljan of Popovic organized resistance against the Ottomans and joined forces with the Montenegrins. The Kuchi, identifying as a Serb tribe, asked to be united with Montenegro. After the Berlin Congress, Kuchi was included into the borders of the Principality of Montenegro. At the Battle of Novshitsa, following the Velika attacks, the battalions of Kuchi, Vasayevici and Bratanozici fought the Albanian irregulars under the command of Ali Pasha of Guzanj and were defeated. Anthropology Old Kuchi The Old Kuchi was a community of a larger number of clear and composite brotherhoods. In relation to the Drekolovici who claimed ancestry from one ancestor, J. Urdal Janovic found in the Old Kuchi very noticeable instances of the merging of various diverse brotherhoods into one. The merging was so finalized that it was hard for him to mark off the parts of those composite brotherhoods. Even the searching in that direction was also encountered in the sensitivity of individuals. With the arrival of the Drekolovici, the old families called themselves Old Kuchi. Of the settled brotherhoods of the Old Kuchi, the Mernyavsisi are the most notable and the representatives of Old Kuchi. The Mernyavsisi, the largest brotherhood of Old Kuchi, numbered 330 households in 1941. All old Kuchi have the Slava of Mitrovden. J. Urdeljanovic wrote down data from all over Kuchi, the most intricate from Kranj, Zikovice, Kostrovice, Bezihovo, Kut, Podgrad and Lazos. All of these narratives agree that the Murni of Sisi Brotherhood descend from Goko, the brother of King Vukasan. Goko's descendants were forced to flee Skardar with the Ottoman invasion, and settled in Biastan, Dediki, 3rd Yavici, Mernivsevici Vudosevici, Krivo Doljani Nicholas I Bojovici Gosovici Milisai Mitrovici Nikici Pikovici Perkovici, Mernivsevici Pantovici, Ilici, Nikzici Muratajasai, Niksevici, Nikici, Zivkovici, Arusavici, Drekolovici The Drekolovici, also called New Kuchi, descend from Drekale, who settled Kuchi in the second half of the 16th century. There are several stories on his origin. He was either a Merni of Sik or the grandson of Skanderberg. According to Mariano Bolitsa, Lael Drekalov and Nico Rekov held 490 houses of the Chazi Albanese, with 1,500 soldiers, described as very warlike and courageous. The Drekolovici, the largest brotherhood of Kuchi, numbered close to 800 households in 1941, roughly half of all of Kuchi. Bulajici Setkovici Chovic Milinisci Pasadlisi Popovici Prindisi Radani Stanisi Todorovici Vukilovici. Sehovici Bozovici Mikovici Kamovici Barisi Pavisovici Bozovici Prelovici Radiovici Radonici. Ivanovici Bakovic, Yukovici, Mithovici Bogovici Mujovici Kolovici, Mila Sisi Dosovici Yabovici Nesovici Turkovici, Popovici Mirceta Ilikov Drekolovic, Barjak Tarovici, Petrovici, Rasovici, Radonici, Turkovici Lalev Drekolovic, Vusatici, 
Vujasisi Dakovici Jaksici Lubiarici Stefanovici, Vujosovici Bozovici Veskovici Rasovici, Vukoslavsovici, Vuksanovici, Dispersed Families Turkovici, in Podjorica, descendants of Vukilikov, Islimize Kalatsi Pur of Milasic Bigovici Sarbanovici, Zatrijebak Zatrijebak is a subregion of Kuchi, located in the Kuchi frontier, which also compose Orahovo, Koshi and Fundina. From Albanian point of view, Zatrijebak is an extension of the northern Albanian Malaysia region. The population is Roman Catholic by majority. The historical tribe of Zatrijebak, as well as Hot, claim descendants from a certain Keq Preka. The mythological founder of the other half of Zatrijebak was Bangkeki, who is said to have arrived some 100 years after Keq Preka. In Albanian, the inhabitants are called Triogen and Triogen. Triashi was known for starting an Albanian Highlander uprising against the Ottomans in 1907 with the victory in the Battle of Lamarja, fought at the Semi River, in which 150 Triashian participated. According to the locals, the only thing separating the two forces was a bridge over Semi. Other battles that followed in the region include the Battle of Desik. Descendants of Zatrijebak families mostly inhabit the town of Tuzi or the capital Podjorica, while many others have migrated to the United States. Bankechi, Bardakeri, Bunikanji, Gasivici, Ibrisevici Bizishi, Milisai Bankanji Bektezi or Bektezvici Kobilisai Longkarevici Mulisai Besaraj Asai Adimovic Topalovic Memsavici Benjkanji, Mernyev Savici Beruza Bokasi Bakici Ganasai Radansisi, Skepili Bardakasai, Aurapaj, Kakai, Dedi Vanaj, Dukaj, Gashaj, Gegaj, Gielo Shaj, Gorkaj, Gornaj, Gorlekaj, Garashaj, Gurav Kaj, Hasanaj, Leko Kaj, Lukaj, Flag Bearer, Marjalaj, Mem Kaj, Mikakaj, Nikolaj, Nik Prelaj, Palushaj, Prenkokaj, Ukaj, Flag Bearer, Families elsewhere descending from Zatrijebak families Kuranaj, migrated to Guzanj, Vataj, migrated to Kosovo, Gyekaj, migrated to Guzanj. Other families in Kuchi Bakosovici, Basaki, Nelovici, Perovici, Bardni, Bardonji, Visovici, Bechirovici, Baganovici, Berovianini, Visici, Biscovici, Bibisai, Bisovici, Milicovici, Isavasai, Vladimiri, Bialadinovici, Humchi, Humak, Umce, Brakanovici, Brakovici, Brown Oversai Mihailovici Thirdalovici, Bronsovici, Bubarasai, Bulatovici Bolanzici Budenici Bojanovici Boyanasai Tadasai Tomasovici, Bunsi, Grujici Barak, Race, Redzovici. Connections with other tribes It is also believed through folk telling that Grca Nenadov of Old Kuchi had two brothers, Krsto and Seiko, who were the founding fathers of the Kastrata and Shaljani tribes. Many Mernyevchiviks crossed over to Islam, among the most notable the Ganasai in Rozaj and Radanjisasai in Guzanj. There are sources that point that the Kelmendi clan of Malaysia are of Serb origin, that the founder came from the Morakei, Paperiai, Hurtagavina. A certain KL men from Kuchi settled first in Hoti then resettled in the present clan area. Among some Kelmens, Nikola Ostromny Kolmandir is the founding father. Folklore Stories A famous story about the Kuchi is one from the 18th century. The Turks advanced in Zeta towards Kuchi and the troops organized themselves at the village of Begovic. The vizier of Shkoda sat in the Begovic tower. Soldiers were standing outside when the vizier shouted to two Serbs from Oraravac who were in Ottoman service. Hulja Jovanov from Podgrade and Aveza Vukov from Kudani. Hulja, I will give you the Sultan's bajak and you will carry it towards Kuchi. The vizier ordered the flag to be taken by Jula. 
Georgia answered, My Pasha, my honor does not permit me carrying your flag towards my brothers, in which the vizier lowered a rope from his window, either you take the flag and carry it in front of the army, or you take this rope around your neck. Georgia replied, God help me, for I will take the rope instead of the flag against Kuchi, and he went up on the gallows pushed the flag to the side and took the rope, tightening it around his neck and stood himself on the baton. The vizier warned, I will tell you this only once again, take the flag or we will remove the baton that you stand on. Georgia, I will remove it myself so that you won't need to exert your Turks. I stand by my relatives and would proudly die for them. Then a Muslim Slav named Poonin Dedan, himself from the same tribe, said, At whose house is the crow shrieking today? Georgia replied, At mine today and yours tomorrow, and kicked the baton, hanging himself. The vizier turned to Aveza, What will you take, the flag or rope? Aveza answered, the same as Georgia, never the flag, and walked up towards the gallows. Another Muslim Slav, Sulman Kut, a close relative of Iveza, turns to Ali Paso Osmanagic and begs, If you are a good Turk, don't let him die. Ali Paso stops Iveza and asks the vizier, Honorable Pasha, can I pay for his life? No. Can I give my son instead of him? No. Then I will give money, my son, myself, everything for his sake. I will not let him die. The vizier looked carefully. Okay, I will give him to you. The soldiers cheered at the honorable gesture. Demographics. There are over 15,000 residents in Kuchi, with over 3,000 homes. Two major ethnic groups inhabit the region, ethnic Montenegrins and ethnic Serbs, though these may be regarded as one, as some families are may politically be split between the two, i.e., with one brother opting for a Montenegrin identity and another a Serb. Most of the inhabitants are followers of the Serbian Orthodox Church, while a minority are Muslims by nationality. There is an enclave of Roman Catholic Albanians in the village of Kochi. Christian Orthodox residents used to be split into two distinct groups, Old Kuchi and Drekarlovics, New Kuchi. The Old Kuchi is generally seen as being of Serb descent and a native or have settled in the area at the time of the Serbian Empire in the 14th century. The New Kuchi are a large group of clans that were formed after the 17th century and share a legendary ancestor, Drekale. The Islamization of Kuchi has made a minority of inhabitants declaring as simply Montenegrins or Muslims by nationality and Bosniaks although they trace the same origin with that of their Christian brethren. People, born in Kuchi Drekale, chieftain of the tribe and progenitor of Drekalovici or Novo Kuchi. Lael Drekalov, chieftain of the Kuchi tribe, Drekale's son. Iliko Lalev, chieftain of tribe, succeeded his father Lael. Radonir Petrovich Vojvoda of the Kuchi tribe. Marko Miljanov, clan chief, Montenegrin general, and writer. Evgenij Popovich. Mihailo Ivanovic, Vasa Karapik, Novak Milosev Vujardinovic, Standard Bearer, Mita Lakovic, Commander of the Montenegrin Army at Shkadre, Sipo Spayak, Montenegrin Army General, Pop Milosev Drakulovic, Priest, Pop Pero Ivanovic, Priest, Pop Bozo Vujosvic, Priest, Anna Ivanovic, Famous Serbian Tennis Player, Thoko Prelovic, national hero. Bozina Ivanovic, President of Presidency of the Socialist Republic of Montenegro. Branimir Popovic, actor. Miladin Nelovic, actor. Branislav Milasic, football coach. Dusan Perovic, Assistant of Finance Ministry. Dusko Vujosvic, a basketball coach. Dijan Radonic, former basketball player and current coach. Branislav Prelovic, former Serbian and Greek basketball player. Aleksandr Vujosvic, former basketball player and member of Democratic Party of Socialists of Montenegro. Georgia Bozevic Giska, notable Serbian gangster and paramilitary leader. Ratko Thokic Cobra, Serbian-Swedish mob boss. 
Branko Rasovic, former Montenegrin football player, Bogdan Milik, Montenegrin footballer, Miroslav Vujardinovic, Montenegrin footballer, Anti Mirotovic, former Montenegrin footballer, Vesna Milasic, Montenegrin singer and songwriter, Marina Kuc, Montenegrin swimmer, Suzanne Alazovic, Montenegrin handball player, by descent Pavla Della Basic, Serbian footballer, Vuk Rasovic, former Serbian football player and current manager of Partizan Belgrade, son of Branko Rasovic.